What is up, Legends? We are going on the hunt today, and uh, we got several stores we're gonna check out, uh, and we're gonna start off at our uh, typical spot, Walgreens. So, uh, and there's some other spots that uh, we haven't checked out before, so I'm excited to see if we find anything there. Let's go. today and uh, by the way if it's your first time here my name is Luke and after 20 years I started collecting Pokemon cards again basically chasing that uh, nostalgic feeling of my childhood so I hope you'll uh, come along the journey with me by hitting that subscribe button but let's head to the next door when you first think about Pokemon cards I don't know what the first thing you guys think of but for me it's country fried chicken believe it or not Cracker Barrel actually sometimes has Pokemon cards so we're gonna go check that out right now Make sure you do check out Cracker Barrel. That was pretty crazy. Um, they didn't really have anything in the section they were supposed to be in. Yeah, it's a bit crazy because it's raining out. And uh, but I just turned turned around the corner and the, there's a Pokeball kind of sitting there, right up top. And I was actually about to get it. I was about to check out, but it rang up as like $19 after tax. Um, and it comes with three booster packs. I don't know. Maybe I'll come back, but that seems like kind of high to me. We'll, uh, we'll keep looking and depending on what we find, maybe we'll have to come back and get that. Let's check out Hobby Lobby. so far but I, I do know that they often carry them so it's worth a check for you guys but I haven't found them at this Hobby Lobby so far. All right next we've got CVS and this is right next to the coffee shop that I'm gonna be working at today so it works out well. Have you guys ever found anything at CVS? Because I never have. This toy section is so small, but we will keep looking after I get a chance to work for a little bit and then we'll go out on my lunch break and check a few more stores. in the car and we'll go hit up a few more stores. So I think we're gonna go hit up Walmart and this particular one had a huge restock last week. And so it was actually on the same day last week that we were out. So I'm curious to see if they maybe got another restock or maybe they still have some stuff left over from last time. need some more of these. And there's their mystery cube again. Yeah, it looks like what they had was just what they had stocked last week. So they just had a little bit left. Let's go check out Five Below right next door. Nope, didn't find anything there. I do see that there is a TJ Maxx over here. I don't know if they ever have anything, but let's check it out. Mm -hmm. 
well, the lady said that they had a few on clearance, but no more. Well, I hope you guys get some benefit out of uh, seeing what's in stock at these different stores, even though I'm not necessarily getting anything from these. Um, I do still hope that I can find something. I think we may check one more store, probably Barnes & Noble. But of course, if we don't find anything, we'll still open up something back at home. some battle styles blisters some flat battle styles etvs as well and the battle decks but yeah nothing that i'm really interested in right now and i really don't want to come away empty-handed today we'll check maybe one more walgreens and then we'll call it a day that's all we got all right guys it is what it is didn't find anything at walgreens and i kind of and regretting not picking up that uh, Pokeball tin at uh, Cracker Barrel. Maybe we should go back there and see if it's still there. All right, we are back at Cracker Barrel. And honestly, I should have just got that tin. The fact that it was the last one, it was at a random spot, should have been a sign. And, uh, you know, the price is actually not bad considering there might be an Evolutions pack in there. So uh, let's see if it's still there. <laughs> Too. All right, guys, the Lord showed mercy on my soul. We still got that Pokeball tin. So we'll see if we have some good luck to pull an Evolutions pack from this. But let's head back home. All right, guys, well, there were definitely some tough pickings today, which uh, sounds like something that they would say at Cracker Barrel. But anyway, uh, we ended up with this uh, awesome Pokeball tin. Doesn't it just kind of make you want to throw it? Anyway, let's uh, go ahead and open this up. Last Pokeball at the Cracker Barrel. Must mean it was meant for us. All right. And just trying to be a perfectionist and get all the plastic off. <laughs> What do we got in here, guys? Sun and Moon. Burning Shadows. Oh, yeah. There we go, guys. All right. Some good stuff. And a coin. What is that? Don't recognize it. Maybe Wall Canyon, I guess. All right. Let's get hyped for this, guys. I do like Burning Shadows as well, so some good picks. Here we go. Alrighty. Code card for you. Ford. Boom. Big Malasada. Okay, interesting. Steeny. Polywhirl, nice. I like that. Uncommon there. Another Eevee. Yeah. I'll always take an Eevee. Crab Brawler. Yeah. Marini. Diglett, a little in Diglett. Dupider. Reverse Masquerade, Masquerade, and Cosmoem. Okay. On to Burning Shadows. Water Energy, Metapod, Semi-Seer, Porygon 2, Duskull, Epsir, or Esper, sorry, Morlul, Charmander, it's a great card, I like that one, Porygon, 
reverse escape rope, and a Tangrowth. All right. Let's see if we have any better luck in Evo. Yeah, green code card, so maybe not. Maybe not. Uno dos trace. Either way, it's always fun opening Evo because got some great classic artworks in here. Poliwhirl, Brock's Grit Trainer, Professor Oak's Hint, Magikarp, Ghastly, Sandshrew, Weedle, Tangela, we have a Reverse Hitmonchan, very cool. I don't have that one yet, so I like this one a lot, I love that artwork. Just uh, give a second to marvel at it. And we're ending off on a Dugong. All right, well, again, not the best today, but got some cards that I'm definitely gonna be adding to my collection. If you guys like this video, I think you'll also want to check out one of these videos on screen next. Also, don't forget to subscribe to get more Pokemon card openings and hunts in the future. And lastly, I want to give you guys a special message for anyone who stuck around to the end of this video, and that's that God loves you, and uh, he has an awesome plan for your life, and I just hope that that encourages one of you who's watching today. Thanks a lot, and I'll catch you next time.